Welcome back, sports fans. It's Challenge Day. GHSA playoffs continuing from sweet to elite. We have your highlight scores and more. Let go. We head to Vidalia, Northeast on the road in the Class AA Elite 8 matchup. And this one would be all east side out loud from the start as they are coming in hot. The nice feed inside to Zion Odoms for the easy bucket. Then it's nice ball moving again inside to Odoms for the jam. Odoms was just a beast early on and often. Here he is with another basket as Northeast runs off the first eight points of the game. Vidalia has to take a timeout, but they do get on the board as Sirico Jones knocks down the three pointer. Get in there. Yeah, yeah, but it was just the Raiders night. Travion Solomon at the halftime buzzer. They lead 40 to 17 at the half. They don't look back. They go on to win and end Vidalia season 67 53. Fired up Northeast. Fired up. Moving on to Milledgeville versus Northeast Whitfield. The visitors go on a six nothing run with back to back triples. To open the contest, but the Brave Vets, they would gather themselves. Here's Cassidy Neal, as the cheerleaders would say, she takes it to the hoop, takes it to the hoop, hoop. Then check out Madison Ruff, and she doesn't stop till she gets enough weaving through traffic and closes the gap to four points. The second quarter, Janiah Walker for the home team. She is just so much stronger than all of you. The freshman with the three point play the hard way. Baldwin survives and advances with the 57 46 win. They move on as well. Warner Robins hosting Greenbrier at the Demons Inn on the south side. Third quarter action. Jada Morgan with the muscle. That's a three point play the hard way. The Demonettes lead by 14. Later in the same frame, Tasia Agee dishes to Tori Davis. Whoop! That's the kiss off the glass. Now baseline, Tasia Agee, soft corner jumper, count it all, joy. Visitors, they try to make it a comeback, but Big Red holds on and they holds them off. Warner Robins, they move on to the final four with the 63-56 win. They'll be playing in the Valley this weekend. Other scores, Central Lady Chargers run their come to an end, 56-34 on the road to Pierce County. Great season for Coach Tamara Bolston-Williams. Hancock Central girls, they win a close one over Montgomery County, 58-56. They will play on in Taylor County. They take down Dublin at Lady Irish 54 42. They will move on as well.